Hello, how to solve this exponential problem? This is negative 9 to the power of n equals 9. So we are going to start by simply replacing this negative 9 here with 9 times negative 1. We have negative 9 is 9 times negative 1 raised to the power of n equals 9. So if you have a times b raised to the power of c, this equals a power c times b power c. So we have 9 power n times negative 1 power n equals 9. Now what I'm going to do will be to consider this by last identity. If you have a power i times pi plus 1, this equals 0, meaning that e power i times pi equals negative 1. Move this one over here. So this is negative 1. We are going to replace it with e power i times pi. So from here, we have 9 power n times, this is e power i times pi raised to the power of n equals 9. So from here, if you have a power n raised to the power of n equals a power n times n. So we multiply this, you have 9 power n times e power i times pi times n equals 9. From here, we apply natural log. If you have natural log of 9 power n times e power i times pi times n equals natural log of 9. If you have log a times b, this equals log a plus log b. So this is a, this is b. Now from here, we are going to have natural log of a times b simply means natural log of a plus natural log of b. That means we are going to have natural log of 9 power n plus natural log of e power i times pi times n equals natural log of 9. If you have log a power b, this equals b times log a. So natural log of a power b equals b times natural log a. And come behind this. Come behind this. So you simply have n times natural log of 9 plus i times pi times i times natural log of e equals natural log of 9. From here, and then this we have an element plus i times pi times n. This cancel this, we have times 1 equals element. So from here, there's n here, there's n here, we can factor n out. This divides n, I have element plus this divides n, I have i times pi equals element. From here, I isolate this, I divide this by ln9 plus i times pi. Divide this by ln9 plus i times pi. This cancel this. From here, I have n equals ln9 divided by ln9 plus i times pi. And remember, you can express this as n equals l. 9 is 3 power 2. Divided by 
This is ln of 3 power 2 plus i times pi. So from here, I have n equals 2 times ln 3 divided by 2 times ln 3 plus i times pi. So this is our answer based on this method. So let's consider the second way of solving this. Negative 9 power n equals 9. You also replace this with this is neg negative, this is 9 times negative 1. Raise to the power of n equals 9. So from here, remember if you have square root of negative 1, this equals i. This is negative 1. Now, if you take the squares, this comes to this, we have negative 1 equals i power 2. So there's negative 1 here. We are going to replace it with i power 2. So we have 9 times i power 2, which is negative 1 here, or n equals 9. If we apply natural log, like 9 times i power 2 power m equals natural log of 9. So from here, if you have natural log of a power b, this equals beta natural log of a. So this comes over this. You have n times natural log of 9 times i power 2 equals natural log of 9. Now, this is just like having natural log of a times b, which equals natural log of a plus natural log of b. So we are going to have n times natural log of 9 plus natural log of i power 2 equals natural log of 9. From here, you can isolate n. You divide this by natural log of 9 plus natural log of i power 2. Natural log of 9 plus natural log of i power 2. This cancel this. n equals natural log of 9 divided by natural log of 9 plus natural log of i power 2. From here we can have n equals natural log of 9 is 3 power 2 divided by natural log of 3 power 2 again plus natural log of i power 2. And if you have log a power b, this equals b times log a, meaning that natural log of a power b equals b times natural log of a. So that means we are going to have n equals 2 times natural log of 3, and this comes over this. If I have 2 times natural log of 3 plus 2 times natural log of i. So that is it. The both solutions are correct. Here we have 2 times natural log of i. Where here we have i times pi. So you can see that to can natural log of i equal the same as i can spike. So the put answers are obviously the same.